for example, is the oldest written myth that humankind has. We found on these clay tablets written in cuneiform, um, dating back 5,000 years. And isn't that literature? Isn't that important? And the real honest religious position is to deal with one's own shadow and one's own struggle. It's not just Christianity. Of course, it's happening with Islam. Now, I would say that as the world has become more and more uncertain, people wind up going more for fundamentalist ideas because what happens then is everything is solved and everything is answered, and all you have to do is believe. They, they tell us the story about when these black robes came to Canada. A long time ago, they came, you know, and they sat around these huge council fires, and everybody would tell their story. So the Lakota people were there, and they talked about how they came out of the Black Hills on purple horses before time. You know, it's a wonderful, beautiful story. When they got through telling this long, beautiful story, everybody goes, oh, good story. And then the Cherokee people talked about how they came out of the cave. Everybody said, oh, good story, you know. And everybody said, oh, beautiful story. And it came time for the black robes to tell their story. And so they told the story of Adam and Eve, huh? In the Garden of Eden. And everybody goes, ooh, good story. Now I got a story. And they go, no, no, no. No more stories. Our story is the story that you must believe. And they go, no, wait a minute. His story was pretty good. The purple horse thing was a pretty good story. You know what I mean? I liked that story. It moved me. I felt good about that. It excited me, and I go, no, 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 that's, that's blasphemy. This is the story. And you go, wait a second, you guys, who invited you? Hey, tell these guys they got to go, you know, because they're not honoring everybody. There's, there's no respect here. And take that book with you, you know, because we can't read anyway. And if we're so busy reading that book, we got fishing to do. We got hunting to do. You know, we got herbs to gather. We got life to live. You know, we ain't got time to live our lives through the stories of someone else.